Hi, I'm Gav Munro. I'm a British artist living in China, and I'm going to explain to you how I did an effect on Artivive that brought one of my favorite guitarists to life. So first of all, I'm going to show you the effect in the gallery. All Things Must Pass just shows the nature of the physical world. Everything is changing animation. all the time. We and get bored audio interviews and this. we die. But we are in this body and we go through from birth to death. We stay the same. The soul is the same, but the body is changing. And here's me painting the original painting. Now what I did with this, which helped it on Artivive, was to make the contrasting colors very strong. So if you see, it's very lots of lights and darks, and that helps on Artivive. That helps it to recognize the scan. Now I used an, another app, a free app called Mug Life. With the Mug Life app, you can do all kinds of very simple animations. It'll animate still images really well. There is an upgrade, but on the free version, you just you upload the image, and when it loads, it loads a very good default animation. You can see that I just wanted a very subtle animation to bring it to life. Now, the upgraded version, which is ten dollars, you can refine the alignment of facial features which is not really necessary but this is what it does as you can see it's auto mapped the face really well on the free version there we go so now I'm going to set the length of that animation to 30 seconds and save that save it to my camera roll as a video loop and that'll save 30 seconds of the animation without audio to my iPad then I transfer from my iPad this video over to my iMac to start video editing the audio together with the video. So I use HitFilm Express as my video editor, um, but it's very much like Final Cut or things like that. So first of all, I'll import both the video file from Mug Life and also the audio file at the interview. So here's the video file which again is 30 seconds, which is good because Artivive recommend up to 45 second videos. And there's the audio. So I'm just gonna select the part of the audio interview that I want. And then drag the video onto the video track and the audio onto the audio track. And then set the export parameters. I'm going to add a little fade as well to the video track. Just to give it a nice effect. Give it a little test. Yeah, video, audio working. Great. Now, I'm going to export that. And then we're all ready to upload to the Artivive bridge. Now, when we get to Artivive, which is bridge.artivive.com, in my account, I have used two of the three complementary artist slots or projects that they give you. First of all, you have to add the artwork. Now, you have to add the title first. George Harrison, All Things Must Pass. And then add the artwork. Now it'll give you two options here. You have to upload an image here and a video on this side of the screen. So we just select the image file. And that's a still image of George Harrison that will activate the video in the AR experience. There it is, so we'll just upload that. 
and then we're going to upload the video now that we did in Mug Life and then in Hit Film. The video with the audio here. Now press add there. When, when you press add, you get three options. You can cancel, uh, yes, please adjust the video, or upload as it is. I would recommend that you go with the yes, please adjust the video because that what that does is it lets Artivive crop the video to suit the aspect ratio of the painting. Now the upload process has never taken me more than 30 seconds. And here we go, you'll see that it's added it to my account and it processes it. It takes about 10, 15 minutes to process the project. And there you go, that's how you do it. So thanks for watching and here's the effect again. All Things Must Pass just shows the nature of the physical world. Everything is changing all the time. We get born and we die. But we are in this body and we go through from birth to death. We stay the same. The soul is the same, but the body is changing.